Well, the woman who was involved in the attempted murder of a Minneapolis forensic scientist was sentenced today. Lou Raguse has been following this case and joins us live with what happened in court today. Lou? Well, Lauren and Julie, Nicole Ford survived because a bullet missed a major artery in her neck by less than a millimeter. Her ex, Tim Amaker, was convicted by a jury of attempted first degree murder. And his girlfriend, who's also his former Taekwondo student, Colleen Larson, today was sentenced to 16 and a half years in prison for trying to carry out Amaker's plot. Tim Amaker is evil. In a passionate plea to the judge, the defense attorney for Colleen Larson argued that her boyfriend, Tim Amaker, who first met Larson when she was his 12 year old Taekwondo student, manipulated the unsophisticated, naive 25 year old to do his bidding. The manipulation, Your Honor, is so obvious, so clear. She was utterly overborne in this instance by that man. Larson admitted she tried to kill MPD crime scene investigator Nicole Ford, Amaker's ex and mother of his child. Here on surveillance video in April 2022, you see her running up on Ford, drawing a gun and firing several times at point blank range. I mean, I don't know what this has to do with me. Amaker was inside the supervised parenting center with the child, an alibi as he would be the prime suspect after filing several false police reports accusing Ford of child abuse. She still believes now all the lies that Amaker told her. At Larson's sentencing hearing, it was revealed Larson is still under Amaker's spell. Still communicating her love for him, even expressing she wants a future with him. Prosecutors asked Judge Shireen Escalani to hold her accountable. Sure, she's younger than him. Sure, he's charismatic and manipulative, but he's not a sorcerer. And Larson's demeanor, nearly a year later, sticks with the judge. It was Miss Larson who executed the plan. There has been no remorse displayed by Miss Larson for almost taking someone's life. Upon reflection, Miss Larson has stated that she didn't, she doesn't know what she would do differently. She gave Larson 16 and a half years in prison, just a year and a half less than the man she was willing to kill for. And Tim Amaker is serving that 18 year sentence that he received in January. Larson will be released after she serves 11 years of her sentence. Back to you.